let's play the what if game. My wife loves this game. So let's imagine you're out there running some errands, but you have a family pet with you, maybe a parent or a friend or whatever the case is going on, okay? So you're out running some errands, you gotta make a quick stop. But let's say it's 100 degrees outside, you know, something really hot or really cold. So as they're gonna stay in the vehicle, you wanna make sure the climate's on, make sure they're comfortable, okay? So you got the climate and everything set, you got your key with you, because you know you're gonna lock the door behind you, you're gonna shut the door, you're gonna run in. So you can think it's gonna be a quick, maybe a 10 minute trip, but it turns out to be 30 minutes. So now you're coming back out to the car to realize, holy Batman, the car has turned off some time ago. You know, because the car is designed so after 20 minutes, the car is being idled for 20 minutes, it automatically turns off. Now, your question might be, hey, is there a loophole around that? And the answer is yes. So if you have to take 30 minutes, leave your mom in the front seat, make sure she's comfortable, you can do that. It's quick and easy. I'm going to show you. Mom's going to thank you for this. So let's do it. This is going to be a super easy, duper thing to do. All you have to do is simply when you get out of the vehicle, grab your seatbelt, plug it in, boom, shut the door, get your stuff done. That's pretty much it. So when you come back out in 30 minutes, 40 minutes, guess what? The car will not be off. It'll be on and running. Climate's good. Everyone's happy. But if you walk away from the vehicle without your buckle plugged in, 20 minutes later, boom, it will turn right off.